Hi folks, welcome back to The Brave and the Boys. I'm your host Jake and with me is the amazing Jess. This is my girlfriend, my better half. I like to say that, you know how they say better half is an expression? For me, it's definitely true. <laughs> so we have this fun flirty little game going on that we've been playing for a while. Maybe some of you play it with your partner where I buy a lot of books at a lot of packages <gasps> and I just say surprise and I try to like sneak them up into the room and open them without her seeing. But to celebrate hitting 600 subscribers, can you see 600 people actually like watching our videos. 600? We decided to play a fun little game called My Girlfriend Opens My Haul. So she will be doing the unboxing today. And I'm gonna have, hope I don't get in too much trouble. You got some explain to do. So we got books from some various websites. Uh, Amazon, Redbubble, Target, and some from our sponsor, Organic Price Books. Remember, use our code BRAVEBOYS to save $2. And use code... BRAVEBOYS SIT! To save... Five percent! Hey, high five. Fire high five because of the mic. So, do you got your handy dandy box cutter? Cut chow. Deep within a bleak and dismal swamp, hidden beneath its murky waters, lies the headquarters of the most sinister villains of all time. The Legion of Doom. I low-key am a little worried with her with that because every time I go down the stairs after me and Jordan are done filming a video, she's watching the most heinous murder documentary. And it's always like, she snapped and murdered her <laughs> husband. And I'm a little worried to have uh, all these purchases and a sharp blade. What box do you want to open first? That one. Anyone but that one. <laughs> that one's the big one. Yeah, but this is from our sponsor, so we want to open it last because it's going to be special. I'll start here. It's low key harder than you think to open a box on camera, right? Yeah, especially quietly. All right, what do we got here? Show, show it off. Infinite Frontier. Have you read it? Uh, most of it digitally. Mm-hmm. Justice League. I mean, it has my favorite character, uh, the Superman bunny character, who, Captain Carrot. Okay, he's so- He's not in any of these other ones? No, okay, no, he's in Multiversity, which didn't arrive yet. I have the trade paper back. Okay, so this is really important. So, you know her, that's like, um- Princess Cap Leia. We just saw Shazam, that's uh, Miss Marvel. Well, there's three books in there? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no, this is really important. So, I'm filming a video, really a, a Watchmen reading order. So, Rebirth was the very first comic from the Rebirth line. I own it in, like, actual floppy. But it's really important because it jumps off, like, I mean, who that hand is, is really important. Okay. You know who that hand is? I can't spoil it. They're going to have to watch the video. Okay, well then. Okay, okay. So, this is Mary Marvel from another Earth. And then you have, I think it's Calvin Harris, which is, he's Superman, but he's the president. And then you have Captain Carrot, which is Superman, but he's a bunny. You know, I'm always talking about how much I love him. <laughs> okay. Okay, so then Rebirth. This one. Rebirth, okay. So they did this thing called the New 52, where they rebooted the entire franchise of DC Comics and made them darker, gritty, younger, and a lot of people hated it. They missed the old reality. And this is what started the segue back into the old reality, where you realize Dr. Manhattan, remember him? No. Watchmen, blue guy with his dick hanging yes. out? Okay. Oh, nope. It's not seared into your brain? Taking it back. He was the one that caused the New 52, and it's a meta commentary because Watchmen led to comic books becoming darker and more gritty, and it's almost like a, it's a meta, you know what a meta commentary is? No. But have you read it? Yes. Many times. Are you gonna read it again? Yes. Maybe. Soon? I mean, I kind of have it memorized. It's just, uh, I mean, the ending is great. Like, the ending where the Flashes hug each other. And then Infinite Frontier, uh, so these two lead into each other. So it's part of a video that I'm doing. I need him. And you got Flashpoint Batman. That's Batman's dad, but he uses guns. So in that world, instead of Bruce's parents getting murdered, Bruce gets murdered. And the mom just starts laughing. You just spoiled it. She starts laughing. And then she gets a big it's like smile. like the Batman who laughs. Maybe high five again, quite high five because of the mic. Um, the mom starts laughing, it's a huge smile on her face. She becomes the Joker, and he becomes Batman, but he kills people with guns. So it's a really dark world. Important books, use them for a video. I swear I'll read some of them. 
Okay. All of them. Some, yeah, all of some of them. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. All of some of them or some of all of them? All of them. Okay, what's next? This one. Maybe not. You're gonna rip it with your bare hands and go, I rip here, line. I like the fun stickers you and Isabel put on. We worked real hard. Ever graceful. It was twelve dollars. Uh huh. How much was those? Well, no, no, okay. So look at the price. Look where the regular Four. is. Look at the back of it. Flip it. This is called cover price. Can you see that price right there? Mhm. Mm see what is it? What does it say? One hundred and twenty-five dollars. And I got it for twelve dollars. Do you wonder how? How? Okay. So we went to Target. I went to Target and I bought some shorts because I wanted. But because like I wear a lot of sweat shorts when I get home from work. And I wanted something that felt a little more breezy. This is a good story, I promise. But I already know the story. So I bought a couple pairs of these shorts and I bought them too big. So we go back to Target another day. I go to exchange them for a store credit card. And then we go to Target and buy a lot of groceries and stuff. And we leave and I forgot to scan the store credit card or like the store credit thing, gift card. Forgot. So I think I had to, you know, I just, I got it for free basically, right? That's how it works? No. Okay, you so. You still spent the money. What's the book called? Tell me what the book is. Injustice, God Among Us, Vol Omnibus, Volume 2. See? We have Injustice, Gods Among Us, Volume 1, and put them together. Can you see that? Wait, let's flip it around so you can see it. Ah. And I flip it around. Hold on, trade fighting each other. Yeah. So have I told you the storyline of Injustice before? Me? Yeah, have I told you Injustice before? Yes, but I don't remember it. So the Joker kills pregnant Lois Lane, destroys the Daily Planet, like ruins Superman's life, and Superman loses it. I'm trying to find a place to put yeah. it. Yeah. Set it down. Ooh. Ooh. Basically, Superman goes crazy and evil and takes over the world, and Batman has to lead a resistance to fight him. Nice. And I have you read that one? Yes! It is on my list of my favorite DC Omnis for beginners. Have you read this one? No. Are you going to? No. I had to complete the set, but okay, here's why. I hey, love- Jordan, do you want to buy this? You can have it. Speaking of giving books away, we do have a little giveaway. What a great- Can we call her the Segway <laughs> Queen? So for those of you watching, I bought a lot of copies of the Batman Who Laughs. We bought a lot of copies of the Batman Who Laughs. Mm -hmm. And I forgot to do the giveaway in the last video. So go ahead and comment down below, hashtag Segway Queen, and I'll pick a winner in a couple weeks and ship you a free copy of the deluxe Batman Who Laughs. It's the last one to give away, I promise. But how many other ones have you given away? Well, I gave one to Jordan, one to Omnidog. Check out his channel here or here. And one to BJ Kicks from Comics Are Dope. Check out his channel here or here. I never know what direction it is. I feel like you should know by now, but. Here, ready? Let's try, let's try it together. If you want to know more about Injustice, check out my video, DC Omnis for Beginners, here. Or there. No, we had it right. Okay. <laughs> let's set it out. Let's move to the next one. There's two in here. The worst part is I don't even know what they are. Oh, even better. Flashpoint. Or is it? Beyond. Beyond, who, okay, so, <laughs> guys, look at this video. Who is this? Batman. I just told you about him five <laughs> seconds ago. Who is this? Flashpoint. <laughs> okay, so it's Batman, but is that a gun? Batman's dad. Y Bat daddy, there we go. So this is the sequel to Flashpoint, which is leads into these ones. And leads, this is also a sequel to Doomsday Clock. Remember Doomsday mm -hmm. Clock, the one I love, which is this one over here, yeah? So this is a sequel to a lot of things. And look, I got the pay I saved money. I could have got a better version, and I got the paperback. 
You could have saved money and just not bought it. There also is no other version. There's just a paperback. <laughs> oh. Before Watchmen. Which you should read. So if you're gonna read Watchmen, would you read before Watchmen before or after? I'm gonna say before it says before, but I feel like the answer is after. You would be wrong. You there we go. You would read before Watchmen after Watchmen. And does Alan Moore like this book? Yep. Alan Moore hates it and <laughs> probably is gonna curse me when he sees this video. Why do we need mugs? Because they are brave in the boys' mugs! In two different styles. And if you don't want mugs, there are coasters, shower curtains. I really wish that the other box had come because I bought her Brave and the Boys leggings. <laughs> wow, oh my gosh. Yeah, so announcement of our Redbubble channel. You know how they say you gotta spend money to make money? No. Sometimes you gotta spend money to not make money. Oh, <laughs> no. I'm pretty sure you make so little on Redbubble that I actually lose money if you buy these mugs. What? It's branding, what about corporate synergy? No! Are you not gonna use the mug? I'll use it every day. With the coffee I don't drink. She doesn't like coffee. And the hot chocolate he didn't buy me. It was a 48 pack of K-Cups for hot chocolate. And I was like, maybe we buy a smaller amount. Maybe we find if there's like less than an entire office worth of people. So for those of you who said, <laughs> Before you say anything, love, and you get mad at me, we didn't mention in stock trades 2% loyalty coupon discount. I got the 2% discount on this one. So, why? Well, you gotta be 2% less angry at me. Well, because I bought a book. Because you bought a book. I mean, it's been recorded this entire time. Okay, go. Oh. Also, in stock trades used bubble wrap this time. I swear our last video wasn't fake. Looks like we have The Flash. By? Mark Wade. Omnibus volume. One? Yeah. Oh. And see, I didn't buy volume two and three with it. Because it hasn't come out yet? Oh my God, she's learning. Okay, so do you see how many flashes are on there? So we're having another giveaway. No. But this one's called a You Buy It From Us. Which one of them is named Jay Garrick? If you're right, I'll buy you those K-Cup hot chocolates that you want. That one. Did you know that? Wait, Jordan, did you point her? <laughs> Suspicious. It looks like, it just looks like what? Did like, you access What's the, the name again? What name was I looking for? Barry Allen. <laughs> That's not him. That's the wrong name. Okay. Uh, but I that name looks like a guy who would wear a pot on his head. Like the aliens are coming. We got our My last box. Cat. How about this? Grab our cat. So, who is this last box from? Our Organic Christ Books? Yes. Mm. Are you asking me or telling me? I said that with conviction, did well, I not? What if people want to save money on Organic Christ Books? What can they do? They can look at this code right here. You can use the code Brave Voice to save two dollars off your order if you're buying one or two books, or use the code Brave Boys Sit to save five percent. Excuse me. Hello. Wow! Look at that bubble wrap. Oh my gosh! The, I give it a ten. Look at that. On our score of zero to five, you gave it a 10? Yep. How many books are in here? You know, I don't know. I think less than I ordered. I think one of them was back ordered. The suspense, she's good at that suspense. The one that doesn't match. Guys, she knows. 
Okay, we gotta go one at a time. We gotta go one at a time. We gotta go one at a time. Pretend you didn't see that. This is Avengers by Jonathan Hickman, Volume Two. And ready? Grab Avengers by Jonathan Hickman, Volume One. And for everybody to see, let's put our A's together. Boo! Boo! Actually, oh no, that's horrible. That's not how an A looks. Okay, you can put it back. So. This one means I can finally read four other books that I own. So you go Fantastic Four one, Wait, Fantastic Four two. Back then up. A, yeah, yeah. You haven't read a. Yeah, because you got to get Fantastic Four one, mm -hmm. Fantastic Four two, Avengers mm -hmm. one, Avengers two, and then Secret Wars. And according to Omni Dog, and you can find his channel here, you need to read Secret Warriors, which doesn't come out till August, but maybe I won't read it. No. Okay, moving on. You can read it online. Buy it online. Deadpool and Cable? Yes, Deadpool and Cable. It is the merc with a mouth and the gruff guy with an attitude. Who do you think is Deadpool and who is Cable? Deadpool Cable. Heck yeah. Let's show them off. How about this? What if I give you these? No. And it makes up for what I bought. No, I want a vacation. We're gonna take it to Hawaii. Okay, so you said you weren't good at intros. Do you know how to do an outro? No. What book are you most excited to read? You know, I did, there was supposed to be one more box and there was a book from Tiny Onion that I was gonna give you called Department of Truth, but that'll be on the next one. Aww. That's a deluxe looking something that's killing the children. Okay, so you're gonna do an outro. No. So what you're gonna say is, guys, thank you so much for watching. No, that's what you're doing. <laughs> hey folks, thank you so much for watching. If you had fun with Jess and me, Please comment down below. Give us a like button. Give us a smash that like button. Say smash that like button. Smash that like button. Sounds good when you say it. Like, comment, or subscribe. Right? I mean, I already did. Think if you up if you like this video, if you comment, comment if you want more Jess in future videos. Say if she really is my better half. I mean, think about it. we gotta we gotta have you on to do your book review of something is killing the children. Oh my goodness. We should do a Jess book club. There's already one. This was a lot of fun. How mad are you at me? Madder than you thought you'd be or less mad? Like, what's the scale? 14 packages. 14 packages? What do you mean 14 packages? There was not 14 packages that arrived in time for the video. Do you want another cat? <laughs> yes. Comment down below if you think I should get her another cat. Thank you. And remember, one more time, smash <laughs> that like button. <laughs> doesn't mean that kind of smash. It means clicking it the button. It sounds like icky. Okay, for the last thing, grab the Thor hammer that you built for me. And remember, smash that like button. <laughs> <laughs> We're past that. It sounds gross, remember? Yeah, but you gave me a hammer to smash things. Do you see anything else you want to smash? <laughs> yes. And remember, keep reading. And stay brave. I wanted to say stay bold, but then you messed me up. No, stay brave was correct. No, I wanted to do it on purpose. <laughs> We can, he was whispering, he was mouthing the right We can do word. it again, it's a thing of power of editing. No one will know, ready? And I keep know. re- It's not funny. Man. It's all lies. <laughs> keep reading and- Stay brave. No, you were supposed to say stay bold. Okay. Did you have fun? Action.